Hello my dear students, in this video we are going to study Basic Theorem of Boolean Algebra Basic Theorem of Boolean Algebra can be proved by substituting the maximum possible values of the variables that is 0 and 1 Here this method of proving the Theorem of Boolean Algebra is called as proof by perfect induction Now let us continue with the properties of 0 and 1. Let us write the first property k with r and write the variable. So 0 or x. So this gives us x. Next b that is 1 or x. So this gives us 1 and c 0 and x. So this gives us 0. Next d that is 1 and x. So this gives us x. Now the same expression can be represented in the form of a logic gate. So here we will write 0 or x. So here we are going to draw the or gate. And the result of this one is what? x. Okay. The second expression 1 or x. So here we will draw 1 or x. So this gives us result 1, right? Next, the third one, 0 and x. So here we will draw and get. And here this gives me the result as 0. Next, 1 and x. So here we are going to perform and a and here the result is what? x. Now, we are going to prove each of these four properties by using algebraic method as well as the truth table. So, let us continue with the first one that is A. Here, we will write the proof. We are going to prove this particular theorem by substituting the value of x is equal to 0 and x is equal to 1. That is proof by perfect induction yes so let us continue with the first expression that is 0 or x is equal to x so we need to prove here lhs is equal to rhs so let us consider here if x value is equal to 0 then we will say lhs that is left hand side is what 0 or x let us substitute the value of x x is equal to what? It is 0. So here we will or between these two zeros. False or false is what? It is false only. So 0 represent what? 0 represent x. x is what? Right hand side. So here we will write this one as RHS. So hence the proof. What is going to happen? If I take x is equal to 1, then LHS we will take. LHS is equal to 1 or x, correct? Yes. So, sorry, that is 0 or x, correct? Now, we are going to substitute x is equal to 1, 0 or 1. Here, it is true, correct? That is 1. 1 represent what? It is x. x is what? x is right hand side. So, here we call it as RHS. Now, let us prove the same with the help of truth table. Okay. Yes. So, here we have got two columns. 0 represent it is a constant. x is a variable. And what should be the result? 0 or x. Here we will write 0 or x. 0 value cannot be changed. Hence, it is 0 only. Right. Now, we will draw the table. Yes. So, value of x could be 0 or 1. Yes. Next, we will perform or between these two columns. False, false is false. Otherwise, it is true. Here is the proof. Now, let us move on to B. Here, we will move on to B and we will change this one as 1 or x is equal to. We need to prove this one as 1. Correct? Yes, if x is equal to 0, then LHS is equal to what? 
1 or x. Now let us substitute the value of x. Here x is 0, 1 or 0 is 1. It is 1, correct? 1 or 0 is 1. Here you can say this is RHS, that is right hand side because we have got 1 or x is equal to 1. Hence the proof. In the similar way, if x is equal to 1, then LHS. So, what is LHS? LHS, I am going to write here 1 or x is equal to 1 or x value is what? 1. Here, 1 or 1 gives me what? It gives me 1 only. So, 1 is what? 1 is RHS. Here, we write the right hand side. Similarly, here we are going to write the truth table. Yes. So, we have got the three columns. The first one is 1. The value of 1 is always 1 only. The x will become 0 and once it is 1. Okay. Next, we need to write 1 or x. Here we write 1 or x. Now, we are going to see 1 or x. So, this gives me what? 1 or x. 1 or 0 is 1 only. 1 or 1 is 1 only. And here you can see the first and the last column are equal. So, here you can say 1 or x is equal to 1 because the values are same in both the columns. Hence the proof. Yes? Okay. Now, let us move on to C. We will rub this and we will substitute the values again. Yes? Okay. Let us continue with C. 0 and x is equal to 0. Here we will take if x is equal to 0 then we will say LHS left hand side 0 and x. Let us substitute the value of x that is 0 and 0. 0 and 0 gives me what? It is 0 only because 2 2 is true otherwise it is false. So 0 is not 0 is 0 only. So here we are not going to write x because we want here 0. So hence it is called as RHS. Now we will substitute if x is equal to 1 then we will write here LHS is equal to 0 into x. So here we will write 0 into x value is 1. Now also it is 1. 0 only. 1 and 0 is 0 only. So, hence it is right hand side that is 0 only. Okay. Similarly, here we are going to draw the truth table even for this particular expression. So, C consisting of what? 0 and x. So, 0 and x. So, 0 value will be always 0 only. x will be either 0 or 1. Now, we will perform adding between these two. So, 0 and 0 is 0 only. 0 and 1 is 0 only. And you can see the first and the third column. Both the values are same. Hence, LHS is equal to RHS. Now, let us move on to proof of D. Again, let me rub this and go for writing expression 1 and x is equal to x. If x is equal to 0, then LHS is equal to 1 and x. So, here you write 1 and x is what? 0. So, 1 and 0 gives me what? 0 only. 0 is what? 0 is x. So, this is equal to you write RHS. So, this is the proof. Next, if x is equal to 1, then LHS is equal to 1 and x. So, 1 and 1. So, 1 and 1 is what? 1 only. 1 represent what? It is x. So, it is equal to x. So, this is RHS, that is right hand side. Now, let us write the values in a truth table. Here we have got 1 and variable x, 1 and x. So, when the value will be? one only correct that cannot be changed because it is constant. Now the value of the variable x could be 
either 0 or 1. Now we are going to perform adding between these two. So here it is true and true is what? True. True and false is false. So here you can see these two columns represent what? LHS is equal to RHS. So hence the proof. Next we will move on to indempotence law. So let us continue with Indian Potence Law. Okay. This law states that when we combine a variable with itself, with and or or operator, then it results in the same variable. Yes. Okay. Let us write A and here we are going to write X or X uses X only, that is the meaning of it, right? Next, B, X and X is equal to X only. For both of these two expressions, we are going to draw the logic gate. Here, we will write X or X. So, how to represent or? We are going to write or something like this. And the result is what? X only, that is right hand side. Next, we are going to perform adding. So, X and X. Results in x only. That is x. Now we are going to prove this one. So let us write a proof. We are going to substitute all the possible values of the variable x, that is 0 and 1. Let us take the first expression, that is x or x is equal to x. So what is going to happen if x is equal to 0? Then we will write LHS is equal to x or x. So here x value is what? 0 or 0. Here we will write 0 or 0 is what? 0 only. 0 is what? 0 is x. x is what? Right hand side. So it is RHS. So hence the proof. Next we will substitute if x is equal to 1 then LHS is equal to x or x. So here we are going to substitute the value of x as 1 or 1. 1 or 1 gives me what? 1. So 1 is what? x only. So x is what? That is right hand side. Now let us draw the truth table for this particular expression. Here we are going to write the variable as x and then we are going to write x or x. So that is x or x. Here the value of x is either 0 or 1, 0 or 1. Correct? Here we are going to perform ordering between these two columns. 0 or 0 is 0, otherwise it is 2. And here you can see any column, any first two columns with the third column, both the columns consisting of the same binary number. Hence, we can say x or x is equal to x only. So, that is LHS is equal to RHS. Yes. Next, we will move on to B. Yes, we will prove this. Okay. Let us write here the next expression that is x and x is equal to x. If x is equal to 0, then LHS is equal to x and x. So here x value is 0 and 0. So this result is what? 0. So 0 is what? It is x. x is what? RHS. That is the right hand side. So similarly, we are going to substitute if x is equal to 1, then LHS is equal to x and x x is equal to, here we will substitute x as 1 and 1. 2 and 2 is not true only, so 1. So that is, 1 is what? x. x is what? x is right hand side. Hence the proof. Next, we are going to draw the truth table for this expression. Here, we have got a variable x and we need to combine this x with the and operator. The value of x could be either 0 or 1, 0 or 1. And we are going to perform adding between these two. True, true is true, otherwise it is false. Again, you can check it out. The third column with the 
second or the first column. The value for both of these two columns is correct. That is same. That is LHS is equal to RHS. So hence the proof. That's all in this video. Thank you very much for watching this video. We will see you in the next video.